Finally home. I hope mom's okay. Mom? Mom? Where are you? Mom? Mom?
stop myself from doing it. From committing suicide. But it didn't only leave me alive. It also left two police officers dead. I killed them. Shot them both. This was not supposed to happen. Doctors testified that I was having a psychosis. Which means that my punishment won't be too hard for me to bear. I have to spend the rest of my life in a mental hospital. Where nurses and doctors are taking care of me. They let me finish my book. And uh, it has helped me. A lot. I wrote a happy ending. Just for myself. I feel better now. I am more at peace with myself. Even though I'm still stuck in this wheelchair. But, uh... I accept that now. I can never forgive myself for shooting those two officers, though. But I have so many supportive people around me now, so... I, I think I will be okay. Dr. Purnell is mentoring me and is watching my progress. I am lucky to have him. Sophie visits me every once in a while. On the doctor's letter, that is. They still think her visits are too destabilizing for me and that it hinders my progress. I keep on telling her how sorry I am for making her life miserable every time she's here. She, do, she just laughs a bit and tells me to stop being so silly. But I can see the damage I've done to her in her eyes every time she looks at me. She found a new friend. One who is there for her and treats her right. I'm happy for her. Though... I'll miss the good moments we've had, knowing that they'll never come back. I think this is a good time to close this book. It has changed my life forever. The End